Like and subscribe right now or this spider will crawl on your face while you're sleeping. You'll agree that most dogs love to show a burst of speed every once in a while. It's only natural for some breeds since that's how they release that extra energy that would otherwise make them a bit cranky. But as with everything, not all dog speeds are equal. Some dogs are a bit slow while others are pretty fast. And in today's video, we've compiled a list of the top 10 canine breeds with the fastest speeds. Number 10. Vizsla. This dog breed is also known as the Magyar Vizsla, the Hungarian Vizsla, or the Hungarian Pointer. It has its origins in the 12th century Hungarian kingdom, where it was owned exclusively by the high and mighty who used it to hunt. To make it to the modern day pool of dog breeds, the Vizsla had to struggle through several periods of near extinction in the 19th century and during World War II. The dogs landed in the U.S. just as the Second World War was wrapping up. Today, the Vizsla is kept to both companionship and as a sporting dog. The breed is known for being affectionate, loyal, and caring. These dogs are also high-energy beings, which is expected considering they were raised to hunt. Additionally, they're also easy to train, which is a dream for any dog lover. Body-wise, they're often described as being of medium size, one of the most outstanding qualities among them. Males average 25 kilometers in weight and 64 centimeters in height. Females, on the other hand, have average weights of 22 kilograms and a height of 57 centimeters. The Vizslas can attain a top speed of 40 miles per hour. With that speed, they are among the top five fastest dog breeds in the world. Before we move on, I've got a little challenge for you that'll take five seconds to complete. So here's the deal. You just leave a like on this video, smash that subscribe button, and hit the notification bell and you'll get 25 years of amazing luck. Try it, it really works. Number nine, Borzoi. Also known as the Russian Wolfhound, Borzoi has its roots in Russia with the name translating to fast in the Russian language. And they live up to it. These long-haired greyhounds, as they've been referred to as on some occasions, can run at speeds of 36 miles per hour. This speed comes with equally impressive endurance levels, which give the dog that extra edge when it comes to covering long distances in the shortest time possible. Just like the Vizsla, Borzoi was a reserve of the few in the gone-by Russian society. The pooches were owned by the Tsars, who put them through hunting trials. The trials were meant to select the fastest dogs that were later used in breeding. Also, the canines weren't available for sale. The only way to own one was being gifted by the Tsar. On the temperament side, the breed rarely barks, preferring to instead remain calm most of the time. Also, they aren't aggressive, but can be if handled inappropriately. And with the majority of breeds, Borzois need early socialization to peacefully coexist with other pets like cats. Number eight, Saluki. Salukis can be categorized as sight hounds, which means their primary modes of hunting are sight and speed as opposed to the more common scent and they do excel on the speed part. The dogs can do speeds of up to 42 miles per hour, beaten only by the Greyhound, which we'll cover later in this video. While Greyhounds take the top position as far as speed goes, the Saluki is revered for its endurance. So the dogs can cover long distances at faster speeds in comparison to Greyhounds, all thanks to Saluki's padded feet. Salukis were bred in the Middle East in a region called the Fertile Crescent. Today, the region is made up of several countries like Egypt, Syria, Israel, Jordan, and Cyprus. In the region, this dog breed was used to hunt game animals for sport and meet by nomadic tribes. While they have remarkable speed and endurance, Salukis tend to be wary of strangers. Also, they're quite independent hounds, which makes training them a great task. They're among those dogs that you wouldn't want to be let off the leash lest they disappear forever. Number seven. Whippet. Whippet is another sight hound breed. It has its origins in England where the dogs were used to chase rabbits as a sport. Most dogs in this breed don't go beyond 20 kilograms in weight. Acceptable heights, on the other hand, vary in North America, the United States, and Canada. Generally, whippets in the US and Canada tend to be larger than those in North America. Their impressive speeds of up to 35 miles an hour can be attributed to their parents, the greyhounds. While they're not as fast as the greyhounds, whippets hold the number one position in as far as acceleration is concerned. They're also the fastest dogs by weight. These remarkable displays have been associated with the double suspension gallop. Here's what it means. 
The four dogs legs are off the ground twice during each running stride. First when they are completely stretched out and the second when the dog is in full contraction. Despite their seemingly active origin, they'll have no problem sitting pretty all day long. But definitely, exercises now and then will do them good. They hardly have an aggressive bone in their body. But you'll have to be careful if you have other smaller pets around since the dogs still retain their coursing instincts. Number 6. Jack Russell Terrier While most dog breeds in our video boast of medium to large sizes, the Jack Russell Terrier is fairly small. It has heights of between 25 and 38 centimeters and weighs in at about 6 to 8 kilograms. Pretty tiny, huh? But what it lacks in size is well compensated for with speed. Jack, as it's sometimes referred to, can attain speeds of up to 38 miles per hour, hence placing it among the first five fastest dog breeds in the world. A look into its origin sheds some insights on the possible explanation for this speed. These small terriers were originally bred for fox hunting in the 19th century England by revered Jack Russell, who had a thing for hunting. But they weren't always the Jack Russell Terriers we know today. The Reverend initially used an English White Terrier in his hunting and breeding exploits. Even though these terriers are now extinct, they form the basis for breeding just the right dog for bursting foxes out of their holes. And that's how the Jacks came to be. As hunter dogs, they tend to be high energy pooches. This means that they'll need a good deal of physical activity if they're kept as family dogs. They also tend to be aggressive to both people and other animals if socialization is lacking. Number 5. Doberman Pinscher This German breed was developed in the late 19th century by Carl Friedrich Louis Doberman, a man of many trades. He was a night watchman, a tax collector, and a dog catcher. The breed has grown beyond the German borders to being one of the most popular pooches in the United States, according to data from the American Kennel Club. This popularity came with the onset of World War, when the breed was used as the official guard dog of the United States Marine Corps. These dogs are among some of the most intelligent and loyal human companions. That's if they're trained properly. Otherwise, they can be a bit aggressive. This was an essential quality for their initial purpose as both guards and war dogs. But today, where most people are just looking for an animal companion, it tends to be a bit of a problem. In fact, they're among some of the most dangerous dogs thanks to owners, to an extent, who had no idea how to handle them. The Doberman can clock speeds at 35 miles per hour and can keep going for a long distance. Number 4. Dalmatian Dalmatians are known for their characteristic white coat dotted with either black or brown spots. It's a fairly large breed with some reaching heights of up to 60 centimeters. This size fit well with the original purpose of guarding carriages. They could easily attack attackers' horses if need be. As a carriage breed, the Dalmatian is endemic to Croatia in a region called Dalmatia, hence the name. Today, the dog is among the favorite family pets. That said, the breed still has the qualities that made it a particularly excellent guard dog so they tend to be reserved to strangers and other unfamiliar dogs. To the owners, they're some of the friendliest and most loyal canine companions. Aside from pets, Dalmatians are also known in sports where they're used as retrievers and trail hounds. The average speed of Dalmatians is about 37 miles per hour, which might have served them well as carriage dogs. The speed is definitely just as useful in the various sports the dogs take part in. Number 3. Border Collie Border Collies were first bred in Scotland for herding livestock, particularly sheep. The most desirable qualities were their intelligence and obedience, which made training easier. According to dog enthusiasts, the Border Collie is the most intelligent breed among dogs. While many years have passed since the development of the breed, these hounds are still widely used today for their initial purpose on top of being favorite pets. If you're looking to keep them, you'll have to be ready to provide a daily dose of physical exercise. This all comes down to the intent reason for development. As such, they're usually a playful lot with lots of energy. In the absence of enough physical simulation, the dog becomes distressed and that's something you don't want to deal with. Border Collies have varying speeds, with most averaging between 20 and 30 miles per hour. Now it's time for today's best pick. Today's photo was sent to us by a subscriber. So if you come across a photo online and want to know more details about it, just send it over to us. We might even feature it on a future video. Number 2. Greyhound The Greyhound is the most popular dog as far as speed is concerned. But nope, it can't beat a cheetah as it has been portrayed in this photo here. 
Greyhounds average about 45 miles per hour, which is a far cry from a cheetah's 75 miles per hour. Nevertheless, the speed's still impressive. Actually, it's the fastest in the dog kingdom. And the Greyhound's body is built just for this. It's slim, has a flexible chest, the legs are long and powerful, and the chest is deep. These qualities work in tandem to help the dog in hitting its speed threshold within the first 30 meters of the race. But make no mistake, these doggies don't require lots of exercise. Their specialty is sprinting, not endurance, so a couple short runs once in a while should do it. Also, they only bark on rare occasions, and after being retired from racing, they spend a better part of the day sleeping. Number 1. Afghan Hound A close relative to Saluki, this pooch is endemic to Afghanistan, as you can pick out from its name. It is one of the most easily recognizable dog breeds thanks to its thick and fine coat. Considering that these dogs lived in the cold Afghani mountains, this coat was a big deal in ensuring their survival. In fact, it was the reason for breeding the hounds in the first place. The tail is also distinct with a ring curl at the end. The dogs tend to be relatively large, reaching heights of up 74 centimeters and weighing in at 20 to 27 kilograms. This coupled with a thick coat can seem like too much when it comes to speed. But as it turns out, these qualities have had little effect on how fast Afghan hounds can go, or we wouldn't be featuring them in our video. On average, this breed can obtain top speeds of 40 miles per hour. While they excel at speed, they're among the hardest dog breeds to train since they tend to be rather aloof. They need as many as 80 repetitions to decipher a new command and have less than 30% chance of obeying a command the first time.